Hey everyone, it's the Vigilant Christian Mario, and you're here for a video I needed to make as a part two to this one that I uploaded earlier today. YouTube is trying to shut down my channel, Help, a video in which I showed you that this morning when I woke up at 7, everything was okay, but by 7.45, all of a sudden I noticed that all these yellow demonetization signs had appeared. And I was highly concerned because normally you can send for a review but it was confirmed by manual review immediately. And, well, now I know why. I've been banned. I've been completely, 100% censored in many, many countries. And I'll show you the proof from YouTube themselves right here. Check this out. So I just noticed this right now where YouTube has sent this to my junk email. Notification of action taken on your YouTube video. At 7.36 a.m., they all flooded, flooded, flooded and flooded in, as you can see. Now, what is the action taken? Let's take one for example here. Regarding your account, The Vigilant Christian, we have received a legal complaint regarding your video. After reviewing the video, Buddhism Predates Christianity Debunked has been blocked from view of the following YouTube country sites. And it lists all of them here. Wow. YouTube blocks content when, where necessary to comply with local laws. Buddhism Predates Christianity. Well, I'm not allowed to share that. And I told you guys this morning too, apparently these countries or those who have put legal action towards these videos don't want Bible studies about unanswered prayer, okay? Do you remember? Let's go ahead and look at some of these. I'm so frustrated with lukewarm Christians. Not permissible in those countries. My heart is broken. A video I talk about uh, uh, anguish and repentance. Jesus set me free of... Um, nope, not available. Not good. And on and on. Unanswered prayer? No, can't talk about that in those countries, apparently. Oh, neither the fact that I'm going to Bible college. That also warrants removal. And so some of the viewers uh, were able to send me what my YouTube channel looks like in one of those countries. And guess what? Not a single one of my videos is viewable, playable. I've been completely banned. Christianity, the gospel, is being banned. The truth. I can't have my freedom apparently, in these countries. So here are what I plan on doing to move forward. I'm going to ask you to go ahead in the links within the description and sign up, download the app, go to the website. I'm going to be on twitch.tv. I created a YouTube, YouTube, wow, I'm going to have to get that out of my head, a Twitch channel called TVC Uncensored, where I'm hoping to be able to do a podcast style uh, show where I can actually discuss these issues. If you kind of seen H3H3's uh, podcast, it's going to be something like that, but with my style of content. Uh, he, I guess, felt it coming a long time ago, and as you can see, he hasn't been uploading to uh, his main channel. For those of you who know Ethan, not promoting him or anything, but just saying that's the action he took, and that was probably really wise to anticipate YouTube censorship. So he hasn't had a problem to share his views on political issues and other things like that. So why should I on this platform? Looks like Twitch is doing it legit, not being Big Brother Orwellian censor YouTube. Anyways, go ahead, please, guys. It's twitch.tv slash TVC Uncensored. And I'll leave the link in the description section. And uh, hopefully we can um, use this platform. I'm going to have to take some time to get to know how to use it. I've never done Twitch before, so bear with me as I go through the learning curve. And I'm also um, going to be encouraging you to be part of the TVC Faith Family Patron page. Um, over here, you can find me. And I just uh, I created what's called a Discord server for those of us who join so we can chat amongst one another. This is a way that you can support me. Obviously, I do this as a, li a livelihood. So waking up today, it's basically like, imagine you went to your job and they said, well, you're a Christian. You have views that we don't like. So we are going to take away three quarters of your income in one blink of an eye. That's it. Done. Because of your faith and your beliefs and the fact that you are very bold at expressing them. That's exactly what's happened to me. 
So I never want to have this ever happen again. Even at a dollar a month, it really will help. And there are other levels, but you don't have to do this. I believe that God will provide for me. I'll be fine. But I do want to continue serving and helping and being a blessing to you. Uh, if I got to get a job and go to Bible college, there's no way I'm going to be able to produce any content, period. It's just not going to happen. You're not going to see Vigilant Christian videos, and that's what they want. This is what they want. They want to um, defund me so that I can't put the time and energy into creating the content for you to get the message that is so important out. And uh, honestly, it, it breaks my heart right now, especially with um, the fact that no one in the UK can hear my content anymore. Um, I received so many messages from people out there who would stumble across my videos and, you know, God was giving them hope. He was giving them truth through that. And um, the enemy just took that away. It's gone. I can't reach them anymore. I've been silenced. I've been uh, thrown into a digital prison, so to speak. And uh, so, Faith Family, I really need your support to move forward. I don't know how I'm going to be able to fight the, the, the fact that they have taken legal action for some reason against my channel. Uh, you can go ahead and tweet out Team YouTube on Twitter and let them know about all this. I'm trying to communicate with uh, managers at YouTube so that we can see what is going on here and why it is that I've been banned from those countries. But anyways, I'm going through a lot. Uh, I have a backup channel for YouTube. It's a vlog channel. Obviously, this type of content doesn't work here. And for those of you who um, remember, I made a video a while back. Let me just bring it up here. I made this video back in May of 2016 where I shared with you that I see myself ending up in jail one day for this. And you might think that's a little bit extreme, but let me tell you, there is coming a time where this speech that I speak, the truth, the gospel, Christianity, will be completely illegal. What we're seeing in the UK and those countries that have decided to ban my Christian content where I express my religious beliefs is basically a foreshadowing of what I anticipate experience here, experiencing here in my home nation of Canada as well. We're going in the same direction. We're just a little bit behind them. So it won't be very long before my own country decides to ban me, charge me, and put me in prison. I see it coming, and I'm telling you, this is the state of the world that we find ourselves in in the final days. So, brothers and sisters, please um, pray for me, most importantly, and um, subscribe to the vlog channel that I'll leave linked up. Uh, subscribe to the Twitch channel. Be uh, consider becoming a patron if you can and supporting. Not necessary. God will get me through. I have faith in it. But I'm um, really heartbroken and messed up from this there. So um, I'm going to take the day to be with friends and family, to have them uplift me. Um, it's hard being a Christian, and uh, I'm just trying to share my faith and my beliefs and what's important to me. And I can't do that on this platform. We can have the LGBT and all those people come here, and they can be proud of who they are. And YouTube's very proud of them being proud, but I can't be proud of being a Christian and a, a Christ follower. Not that I have pride in that. I'm humbled to be saved, but I'm not allowed to be on fire for Jesus publicly and share and express my beliefs, my opinions, and what I think to be wrong with the world and what I see as right. I guess not. It's very hard on me. And brothers and sisters, what's happening to me is a picture of what's coming for you one day. I'm just at a higher place right now, so I become a bigger target. But one day you too will receive this persecution, trust me. And um, when you start losing your jobs and we start going to jail for it, it's going to be tough. It's going to be really hard, guys, and I'm getting a little taste of it beforehand. So um, church, let's get our act together. Let's come together and uh, support one another because the world is really coming hard against us. I made a video the other day saying my heart was broken because of the way that I saw the world changing. And this is exactly what I was talking about. Anyways, I'm definitely messed up from this and I'm just going to take the time to be with loved ones. So thanks a lot.